devastation tonight in Houston. A once in a thousand year storm showing no signs of letting up. Yeah, yeah, my God, my God. With crews stretched thin, neighbors turn into heroes, helping people in need. If you needed proof of just how bad this storm is, this is it. Houston before Harvey on the top, below is how it looks right now. A natural disaster of epic proportion is playing out as we speak. FEMA estimates 30,000 people need emergency shelter right now. Ben is tracking the storm. Jason Colthorpe is with a local nonprofit set to mobilize to Texas. And Hank Winchester is following how we can help. Let's start with Jay Gray, though, live in Houston. Jay? Good evening. We're in a neighborhood that, like dozens across the city right now, is underwater. More than 400 people have been rescued from this community as the rain continues to fall. The water climbing, pushing into places it's never been before. The rain here just won't stop. The people who have lived here 25, 30, 40 years haven't, haven't seen anything like this. Water swallowing entire neighborhoods, forcing its way into homes. This was more than we can imagine. And more than many can bear. The rescue people came and took us to what I was here. Some areas have already taken on more than 20 inches of rain, and before it's over, that number could double. This is a landmark event. We have not seen an event like this. Every member of the Texas National Guard has been deployed, joined by state and local law enforcement, federal agents, and a volunteer Navy, all scrambling to pull thousands to higher ground. Uh, we are still involved in the search and rescue process. Using every available asset, Coast Guard choppers, boats, even flatbed trucks. It's over five feet in our house. We barely made it out. I'm just so grateful that they came. And the effort is far from over. It's still a, a very dangerous situation out there. It's, uh, we're expecting more rain. Rescue teams like the nation's fourth largest city now stretch to their limits, but still delivering survivors to safety All right. and shelters, giving literally everything they can. Thank you. And everything is exactly what they need right now. Yeah, it's something they'll need for quite some time. The rain's expected to continue for at least two more days and then the difficult recovery begins here. Back to you.